The Texas Tech Red Raider football team played host to the Kansas State Wildcats on Saturday. The game was special for multiple reasons. It was senior day for the Raiders as well as a game that honored lone survivor Marcus Luttrell. The team wore a special lone survivor uniforms to commemorate this occasion. All the festivities weren't enough for the Red Raiders as they struggled to do anything on offense and defense for the majority of the game. After two strong first possessions by the offense and a weak showing by the Raider defense, the score sat at 14-10 Kansas State by the end of the first quarter. Tech defense has struggled to stop the run all year and Kansas State took advantage of that the entire game. The second quarter was a nightmare for the Raiders as the Wildcats drove up and down the field on the defense. The offense didn't fare any better. Coach Cliff Kingsbury tried to provide a spark for the offense by inserting Baker Mayfield at quarterback in place of Davis Webb, but an early fumble by Mayfield led to another Wildcat touchdown. At the end of the first half, Kansas State led 35-10. to The start of the second half showed improvements for both sides of the ball, as the Raider defense held strong against the Wildcats' first two drives and the offense showed life from a Baker Mayfield touchdown run. The improvements didn't last long as the Wildcats capitalized on Raider turnovers and the struggles of Tech's run defense. A couple late scores made the game look a little closer than it actually was, but the Wildcats prevailed 49-26. to Kansas State dominated on the ground with 291 rushing yards, 157 of those belonging to running back John Hubert. The lone bright spot for the Raiders was wideout Eric Ward, who had a strong senior day catching 11 balls for 107 yards and a touchdown. The Red Raiders will have to figure out their quarterback situation as well as improve their defense before they take on the Baylor Bears in Dallas on Saturday.